Now, if Pinterest forms a part of your online business, your internet marketing business, if it doesn't, well, it definitely should, then this is a bit of information which you will definitely find useful. And that is the reason I'm sharing this today on Vikram Online Biz. This essentially sums up the limits that you have as far as pins, boards, likes and following is concerned. Because, you know, once you start off on Pinterest, you actually quickly keep going, whereby you are often you've lost track of the number of pins that you've had, the number of boards that you've created and so on and so forth. So this is like a sort of a uh, warning or at least some sort of reminder to you that things are not unlimited and therefore tread carefully and also plan your approach. You know, that's something very important. For instance, when it comes to the number of boards, there's a limit in the sense you can have up to 500 boards. So therefore, if you're creating boards left right and center then you might as well plan things a little better knowing that you can have only up to 500 boards which include secret boards as well as group boards that you didn't create so bear this, keep this in mind then further when it comes to pins you can have up to 200,000 pins which again include secret pins as well as your pins on group boards that you didn't create yeah at the same time to some relief it doesn't include other people's pins on group boards that you created then when when it comes to likes you can have 100000 likes and when it comes to follows you can have 50000 likes so keep these limits in mind see at the same time there is something you know which, which you can keep in mind that if you really hit the limit you can actually go back and delete some pins or boards and you can also unlike pins or unfollow people so that way you can get back but then an easier approach would be to make sure that you keep your things under check and plan your things away because actually this is not that limited as well. This is actually a fair number that 500 boards and 200,000 pins. Having said that, there's still an, a way around in the form of forming a new account with another email address as simple as that so if you've had one email address using which you've registered on pinterest and you've somehow run out of space run out of these uh, limits then you can always go ahead and have another account with another email address as simple as that in fact that's a tip which pinterest itself offers that if you hit a limit the best do is to create a new pinterest account with another email address that way those limits can in turn kind of start afresh on that particular account and whereby again you've say run out of uh, these limits then you can have yet another pinterest account so that's something which you can use to keep yourself going on pinterest having said that against the entire uh, landscape of what i've uh, shared i would say that as an internet marketer as a savvy online marketer as a savvy online business person you should not spam and you should of course Plan your things well and there, there whereby, you know, these uh, limits should be fairly okay enough for you to handle. So that's something which I wanted to share in this video that there are these limits and yet if you plan well and have a structured approach to things, this will not affect you at all. Cheers.